Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. I would say welcome back, but this is something a little different. We're going to be starting a new map, but before we get into that, let's go into options. Just make sure we've got everything set correctly. We are not going to be using the B00 resource pack. We're going to be using Faithful32. You can kind of see that there. And then the other thing we're going to do is take care of some video settings. And what this is going to show you, we are in Minecraft 1.9.2. You can see that here in the bottom corner. And we've got Optifine running. We're not going to be running the other client-side utility mods that you might be used to on my Hypermind Vanilla SMP series. Instead, we'll just do Optifine. We're going to turn on the fog. We're going to bring that down to a 0.2 fog start level. And we're going to bring our render distance down to 10 plus. So uh, the reason why is that we're going to be exploring some different uh, creative limitations here. You've already seen one of them in the title perhaps and uh, so there's no sense in me really playing that out so we're going to be doing a survival island and i really want to get the feel of kind of that close and uh, close in kind of you know just just to really push the feel of hey, we are all alone so we're going to be kind of doing that so we've got everything here we're not going to do shaders yet if we need to show off a build then we'll pull in the shaders but for now I mean, we're going to be on a survival island, hopefully, if this seed ends up correct. So, let's see, other than that, I think we're done. Let's go to single player, and we're going to create a new world. We're going to call this Soaps Survival Island. The reason we're doing Survival Island is a couple, a couple reasons. Uh, let's see, we're going to do Survival, World Options, and I am going to hide this seed from you. But let's go over here. Hopefully, I get that in editing. We're going to just copy this in. Remember, note to future soap looking at this video. If you haven't cop or blocked that out, then you need to go back and do that. All right, we're going to have generate structures on. World type is going to be default. We are going to allow cheats just in case I need to show you some redstone close up and we'll do a uh, little game mode three action. We're not going to have the bonus chest, so we are all done there. And I think. Uh, we are good to go. So let's get this created. We got a few goals with this, in particular working towards a goal that I set for myself on the channel at the start of the year, and that is to become a better commentator. So we're going to be walking and talking through some of this. So yeah, there we go. You can see that we've got a survival island, and the day has just begun. You can kind of see some land poking up there, and you could, you're could you probably thinking, you know, Soap, you could just go ahead and do a boat and go over there but no i want to do this because i really i'm a firm believer that limitations breed creativity we got some lag spikes going okay there we go i thought 1.9.2 was supposed to fix that but maybe not so one of the limitations that i am going to put for myself is staying on this island so um so that's why i want to do that and uh, kind of just stick around here and see what we come up with so one of the first things that we've got to do is get some food going as well. You can see that we've got chickens here, and that's going to be kind of a source of food. But at first, we can't really just go and slaughter all of them because then we wouldn't have any more chickens. So we're going to have to be a little bit smarter about that. And uh, I am going to take care of these trees as well, and we're going to have to make sure that we regrow. Okay, so um, a lot of you might be familiar with the initial stuff with Minecraft. So I'm not going to explain too much of what's going on. We're just doing the punching wood thing. There we go. We got that. And then we'll take care of some of the basic initial tools as well. And then once we dig in to the hidey hole, we should be good for this episode. I mean, that's what, 10 minutes in. So it's enough to explain the concept here. So we're going to be sticking with the survival island. We're not going to be going in search of vast amounts of resources out and about in the world. We're going to stick with what we got. So that is oak for our, our wood type, which means, um, you know, hopefully we can uh, make something that looks nice out of all of that. And um, you know what? We're going to keep, um, we'll keep eight aside there, and then we'll turn the rest here into planks we'll get that and then we can drop the crafting bench on the on the uh, floor there 
and we'll get some sticks and just take care of some of this. I did see some of these saplings drop down. So, uh, yeah, what we're going to do, we're going to have to come up with a place for our, our farm. We can't run around too much either. So, yeah, so while I'm taking care of this, let's just talk about our, our long-term goals for the series. So I said the goal is to become a better commentator, which means we're going to be doing a lot of work on camera. And so you're going to uh, really, I'm, I'm going to be practicing the commentating on you guys. So hopefully it's not too bad. So, um, so hopefully you don't get bored with that. But uh, what I do want you to do is just let me know how am I doing? Um, if we if we need to work on somehow switching up the content, maybe coming up with different topics to talk about, uh, you name it. You let me know. I would love to hear from you. And um, anyway, for now, what we're gonna do is get maybe get our our um, our farm started as well. So we'll get this thing. Yep, time to farm. So we got five sets of seeds. We're gonna do this. And then we'll do another one there. And then eventually we will come along and breed up the chickens. But for now, our focus is going to be on getting our wood production going. So um, let's see. We are going to be trying our hand at better commentating. And commentating specifically while trying to do some of this stuff. So I will take care of that. Uh, I will take care of some of this on screen with you while we continue talking. The other thing is that there are some projects that I'd really like to try my hand at that I am not gonna get a chance to with uh, my, any current series. So are we gonna be replacing any series? No, nope. Uh, we're going to be um, just going with a couple of different series here. So a couple of, um, a couple of vanilla series. So hopefully you enjoy that. And uh, so we're going to do a vanilla single player and a vanilla multiplayer. And we're going to keep Hypermind going. And this is not replacing anything to, to that end. So ooh, we've got some coal to start with. So let's go ahead and get that. Not much coal. Only one? Hmm. That doesn't bode well. Anyway, so let's just continue digging down. And, uh, and and chatting. So there are some projects that I'd really like to try my hand at that I'm not going to get a chance to uh, due to being on a multiplayer server, not not complaining or anything. It's just there are some, uh, some projects I'd like to try my hand at that have already been completed. And, you know, I want to, you know, put my own spin on things. No, we can't. We can't break that yet. We got to get stone tools. So let me get a few more pieces of of cobblestone here and then we'll come back down and grab that iron and then we can get a furnace going as well and we're into some gravel so um so yeah we're not going to be replacing hypermine we are going to just continue doing the single player thing as an extra kind of extra side project if you will so so don't don't worry if you're worried about anything Hypermind related leaving or any other series like that. No, don't worry. Uh, we're going to be mixing this in amongst some other things, and it's not going to be a very frequent um, series. Uh, instead, we're going to be working towards a specific project, and as we do little bits and pieces towards that, um, you know, you uh, you can expect. Um, a video okay so we're gonna be trying to do most of the work here on camera and let me tell you what we're working towards now whenever you go off in search of um, in search of things in and around Minecraft you want to make sure that you've got plenty of food in store so one of the things we're working towards is a good set of, of food and right now the only food that we've got to our name, so we don't even have an apple. Ooh, a lag spike, bad lag spike. Man, that was terrible. So we got a little bit of a farm going, but no apples. I can't even kill these chickens yet. So we are, we're not doing too well in terms of the food. So long term, we can't go on a big journey without some food. 
And so that's what we're going to be working towards is some automated food production. In particular, we're going to be working towards a, um, an automatic chicken cooker. So that's going to be our goal is building an automatic chicken cooker. And you might be thinking soap, that is one of the easiest things you can build. And perhaps it is, but really for the time being, um, this is all we've got. You know, we're going to, we're going to do that and we'll convert the rest to torches and then we can get down into mining. So we've got a stone, a stone pickaxe, got our, got our those are the, the, uh, torches, words, words, words. Okay. And, uh, that's a squid over there. So what we're going to do is we're just going to let the chickens do their thing there. We'll come down here drop a torch in place like so and then we'll see about getting this iron so pretty early on that's iron that's good all right so we're gonna be working towards a chicken cooker and again it's fairly easy but the thing with chicken cookers is that you need um you need a comparator and for a comparator you need quartz and for quartz you have to go to the nether and then the quartz itself is a fortunable item right so, um, yeah, I'm not going to allow myself to harvest any quartz until I have an efficient, no, no, a fortune three pick, which is going to be rather tough given that there is no, uh, there's, there's no supplies for doing any books or anything like that. So getting the enchanting setup going is going to be rather difficult. So we've got our work cut out for us, but I think. I think we're up to the challenge. We've done pretty well so far. Look at that, iron again. Okay, we're not doing too badly here, especially in the iron department. A lot of, a lot of sand, okay. So, so yeah, we've got the iron going. We'll throw some, some of that back into the furnace upstairs, get that cooking. This is great, very, very good. And we're already doing pretty well on our on our production here in the wonderful game of Minecraft. And what we can do also is start taking down some of those. Let's chuck, um, oh, we only got six out of that. I think that's fine. Let's build a, us an ax and did I get some more. I did not get, yeah, I got some, some cobblestone there. Let's build a stone ax instead of a wood ax. This will go a lot faster. And then we can also make a chest just to throw some of this other stuff in. And, and yeah, so um, long term, we've got to work on uh, making this place safe for, uh, for, the, for our, our living. So we're going to throw some torches down. We also need to expand the grassy areas so that we get more passive mob spawns. And we're going to be collecting eggs. This is good. We got got those coming in. And since they are close to us, these chickens, we're going to be getting the egg spawns fairly, fairly frequently. All right. So let's just drop some torches here just to make sure that right around our immediate area, we're going to be fine. Maybe another one right there. And I don't have that light overlay mod going. Oh, lag spike again. Bad lag spike. And then maybe over here we'll have, ooh, already out of torches. So we'll leave that as is for now and, uh, and then kind of go from there. All right, so um, all in all, I think we're doing pretty well in terms of our, our production. We've got iron for various things and we're going to just chop down some more of these. But, um, you know, I'll take care of some more of this, but then I'm going to turn off the game and we're going to just leave, leave it for now. Um, I will do some batch recording in the future. For now, I'm just going to say, what do you think about the concept that we're going for here? Are you in agreement? Do you like this idea? And are there any other projects to, that you think we should explore as we go on the survival island thing.
do let me know. I'd love to hear from you about that and about really anything. So comments, questions, and suggestions, feel free to leave those for me down in the comment section down below. Or you can catch me on Twitter at MCSoapTheGreat. Let's take half of that. We'll make some more charcoal. And there we go. So all in all, we've gotten a pretty good start. We've got some iron going. And, um, and yeah, so next time we'll probably expand our farmland a little bit. And we'll need a house. So um, do let me know what you think. And I will see you in the next one. Bye-bye.